Hello, I'll be the 1AC. Contention 1. Assault weapons increase the lethality of gun-related crimes. Subpoint A. The use of assault weapons increases the amount of victims. Christopher Kober, Professor of Criminology at George Mason, Journal of Quantitative Criminology, March 1, 2001. Those cases in which offenders clearly possess assault weapons are other gun, uh, gun models capable of accepting large capacity magazines claimed an average of 29 victims wounded or killed, while the other cases produce an average of 13 victims killed or wounded. Each assault weapon case also involved a substantial number of other gunshot victims who were not killed. Subpoint B. Since the ban expired, there has been an increase in shootings. Therese Postel, Policy Associate at the Century Foundation, Policy Mike, January 9, 2013. What is striking is that in the eight years since the ban expired, there have been 27 shootings in the United States. Since the ban has expired, there has been a significant uptick in these events in a shorter amount of time. These recent events are inflicting more casualties as well. The deaths of 20 children between the ages of six and seven have brought these hard truths to the mind of every American in the past week. So point C, more than half of 62 mass shooters possess an assault weapon. Mark Fallman, a senior editor at Mother Jones and a former editor of Salon, February 27, 2013. More than half of the killers we studied in our investigation of 62 mass shootings over the last three decades possess weapons that would be banned by Feinstein's bill, including various semi-automatic rifles, guns with military features, and handguns using magazines with more than 10 rounds. The damages these weapons can cause have been on a grand display since last summer, from Aurora to Milwaukee to Minneapolis to Newtown, where attacks carried out with them left a total of 118 people injured and dead. D, assault weapons means less reloading. Richard Simmons, uh, Times staff writer, LA Times. These have no hunting or sporting purposes, but are very appealing to criminals because they mean less reloading. Some of the most horrific mass shootings in recent years were halted only when the perpetrator stopped to reload. E. When crimes are committed using assault weapons, the ability to kill or harm is in, uh, increases in number, increases the number of victims in a short amount of time as possible. Jake Matthews staff, Harvard Political Review. James Hull's shooting in Aurora lasted for at most a minute and a half. Within two minutes, 25 police officers had responded to the scene. Within six minutes, over 200 officers swarmed in the theater. Despite the limited time, Holmes killed 12 viewers and injured 58 others. Scarier still, Holmes uh, .20, 23 caliber assault weapon, a semi-automatic AR-15, jammed during the shooting. When we hear about the massacre in Aurora, we must remember only 12 were killed. An AR-15 is capable of carrying a 100-round drum magazine and of shooting between 50 and 60 bullets per minute. It's incredibly fortunate more lives were not lost. F, the number of casualties has increased since the ban expired. Diana Feinstein, California Senator, statement at hearing on assault weapons ban bill, February 27, 2013. Unfortunately, since the ban expired, over 350 people have been killed with assault weapons. Over 450 have been wounded, and the weapons are even more lethal today than they were in 2014. Contention 2. Uh, Congress should renew the federal assault weapon ban, as proposed by Senator Dianne Feinstein, where an assault weapon is defined as a semi-automatic or automatic weapon that is capable um, of shooting more than seven rounds, and is also um, or can also be altered with a high capacity um, ammunition, which would make it shoot even more. So it bans those two things. So contention A, banning assault weapons will increase public safety. Brady Center to Prevent Gun Violence Data Analysis by Crime Gun Solutions. Following the previous ban, the amount of assault, assault weapons traced back to crime decreased by 66%. When including copycat weapons, this number stood at 45%. As 2001, only 1.1 of weapons traced back to crime were found to be assault weapons named in the act. This is a sharp decline for 3.67 the first year before the ban. This decline is extremely significant to law enforcement and has clearly enhanced public safe safety. 
especially since these military-style weapons are among the deadliest ever sold in the civilian market. For example, if the ad had not been passed and the ban of assault weapons continued to make up the same percentage of crime gun traces as before the act's passage, approximately 60,000 additional assault weapons would have been traced to crime in the last 10 years. An average of 60,000 additional assault weapons traced to crime each year. B. Gun control is a simple solution to eliminate gun violence. Adam Gopnik, writer for The New Yorker, The New Yorker, December 10, 2012. The overwhelming majority of those children would have been safe with effective gun control. I now stand open for cross examination. <laughs> okay. So, in subpoint B, you say that sh shootings have gone up since the, the ban was lifted? Mm hmm. And how, how many shootings have been? 27 shootings. And when it's saying shootings, it's describing mass shootings. OK. In what amount of time? In eight years. OK. Thank you. Um, and then for subpoint C, you said how many of the, in contention one, how many of the shooters used assault weapons? More than half of the killers studied in a 62 um, mass shooter evaluation. And that is that within the same, the same amount of shootings, the 26 shootings, half of them? No. The 62 shootings uh, has been since, uh, the 62 shootings were shootings that happened since 2004, I think. And then this one is just 27 shootings overall. Overall, there's no time period for that. 27 shootings would be, the mass shootings would be more than 10 people. And then the other evidence is just talking about um, like five. Uh, they said it was five or something. Right. Is there a fixed time frame for that? Um, no. Oh, yeah, last three decades. The last three decades. Okay. Um, that's, that's all I have. Thank you. Thank you.